So this is modern art, guys. And uh, this is a mountain, 3K. I'm slowly approaching. But I wanted to show you guys first the spring water here. The, the people of the town here say it's very, very good. And uh, a guy just gave me this fruits, guys, because I couldn't find a shop here. People are very friendly here, guys. Uh, so here's my bag. And, uh, and now let's try this water, guys. Look at this. Spring water. Amazing. They say it's very, very good. Here is 3K, guys. And here is the holy people. Look how holy they are. Look at their clothes like Superman. So today, guys, I found this beauty here. I mean, this is a mess. But what gives me hope, of course, is I will not freeze. There's a fireplace which is really good. And uh, you know, I have to clean all this, but look at this. There is La Scopa. I, I don't know how do you. The, how do you call this in English? I forget. Swipe in the floor. Huh? So it's a mess, guys, but now. With uh, just one click, I will show you how it will look after I finish this mess. So, let's see. A few hours later. Well, it's still creepy, guys, but you know, the fireplace is wonderful. Look at this beauty, man. It was a mess. You know, um, this must have been like a second house of... Uh, because the roof is very, very good, guys. The only bad thing about this house, guys, is that it's all cement. So it's not, you know, it's not very healthy, so to speak. So look what I've done, guys. This must have been the second house of, of an Italian, you know. And uh, some junkies, because I, I, I saw even blood here, guys. All kinds of filthy, as you saw, as it was, you know. And, uh, and you know, if it wasn't for... For this thing here, that I can't find the name in English, it would have been impossible. And so I decided to clean also this other room here, guys, because I wanted all orders, you know. And so here it is. I have wood here, guys. It's all dry. It's, it's you know, I knew it was a beauty here. So the, the window here is, is broken, but there's no problem, because this thing here can be closed. So I have this space here, where I can eat here and play with the fire. And somehow I will have to slip um, over this table, even though it's a bit short. So, I want to show you that they have some art here, guys. Look at this filthiness. It's junkies. So, um, all this uh, filth, you know, it was all, you know, <clears throat> birds would come here and, and poo. And, I mean, it was a mess, guys. I, it was very hard to, to clean all this. But I made it. Um, and all the junk, you know, I put it in this space here, and on that space here, you know, I have the, the fire, and you know, guys, with the fire, everything, here the windows are perfect, with glass and everything, that, that is my solar panel, you know, that uh, now it's not working because the sun is down, and, um, but it charged my, my things, and I, I'm, this is some, uh, papers and things to start the fire and I can't wait to start the fire now guys and you know put my crunchy my crunchy bread on this filthiness here but when I put it on the fire it will be clean this one look at the look at blood here guys look this, this junk is who knows what they've done here I hope they've not done like uh, satanic shit here you know I was thinking so the system has made it so that uh, there will be this huge contrast, you know, like, they create the problem. So, lots of Italians have lots of houses, and they make it so that uh, people also come from uh, other places, and there is this contrast, you know. Uh, and then now they will say, like, oh, guys, capitalism was so bad, you know. Uh, we had people with uh, empty houses, and they would sell for the social. Now we have to share our wealth. Because this is not good, you know, the, the, the rich uh, reptilians, you know, they are so good because oh, they, they care so much about the poor people, you know, 
but that is an excuse to take the wealth of the few ones that still had something like this. So this is, you know, these people just, maybe they will be from Rome and had this second house here. The junkies were ruining it and I just put it in order like this. Look at this uh, slow snow, you yeah? know, just keeps snowing. And here we have cereal. Rosmarino and rice. I'm going to, to this town where I am right now to, to buy some fruits. I'm talking like this because, you know, I don't want people, you know, to see me coming out of that house because I have left my my bag back there, so I, I, it would be easier for me to go down. Still snowing, beautiful. So um, there was uh, just one alimentary, but they said that it has no fruits. So let's hope. I will find something, or some somebody will give me some fruits. So guys, look what I found, guys. I I uh, I took some water because I finished it, and uh, these are real real apples, guys. Not like um, poisoned water. Uh, these are organic, guys. This guy that I found there in the alimentary, I bought some cheese, you know. And there was a guy called Bruno, uh, old guy. Man, what a lovely person, really. He went, since there are no fruits here, guys, there are no uh, shops that sell fruits, uh, he went to his house and he gave me fruits that are from the shop, these black ones, and also he told me, do you want some of this? Man, I said, these are the best one, even though they look bad, you know, they don't look good, you know. These are the best one because these are organic, guys. These are like fake people, you know, of today. This this beautiful one that you buy in the shops. This tastes almost of nothing. This one, these are very aromatic, very good. You know, they have, have real taste. You can, they have so many flavors, you know, these organic apples, uh, and depending on where you take them, depending on the tree and everything. So I really thank Bruno from Teramo that uh, he, he, you know, took me to his house and gave me these apples. The time has stopped to 2009 here. Uh, because, as you can see guys, in this uh, part of the Italy, they have, as I've said many times, earthquake these people. They have put some huge earthquakes so that people move from here. So there are lots of abandoned houses. I mean lots. Yeah, there are lots. And uh, this one, from what I can see, um, has been uh, used also by uh, all uh, walkers like me, like people that uh, hike, like me, or uh, maybe some Romanian or Albanian, like me, of course, uh, that uh, have uh, used this place to, to pass some time. Uh, this is like a, a two-story uh, building, and uh, it's pretty creepy, you know, no, no lights and nothing. And I'm trying to, because the thing that made me uh, decide to stay here, even though it's creepy right now, but, but I will show you how it will come out of, after I clean all this mess, because the good thing is there's fire here, guys. And also there's wood, they have dry wood here stored down there. So, uh, it's just a question of, uh, you know, charging as, as better as I can my, my phone, because there's no other way. Luckily, there's a bit of sun today. Hopefully, this will not go away, uh, not drop. So, look, uh, um, this has been broken by people that have already been here. As you can see, there are traces of people here, guys, that have been here. Look. And uh, and as I've said, you know, there are lots of uh, houses, abandoned houses, because of this, guys. People move, leave these places, and uh, it's kind of dangerous also to stay here. But you know, 
Uh, I don't think the elite will uh, drop an earthquake to me, <laughs> and, and they have done their work, you know. And so th this house, since the time has stopped in 2009, is full of some old stuff that you can see, you know. You know, like uh, if I open these things, you know, it's they're, they're still yeah, like uh, old stuff, you know, but the time has stopped and everything, but, you know, maybe salt could be <laughs> used, but... Uh, Luckily, I don't have a need because I bought something to eat. So let's see uh, what this place will become after I finish it. So, do, do you want me to, to do like uh, that, that trick with the like three, two, one? Here we go. Look at this beauty, guys. So, I was watching this 2009 magazine, guys. Look what they're saying here new, new flu, influenza. Uh, because it's the swine flu. We have to vaccinate 24 million of Italians. So this is 2009, guys. Let me see the, the date. 2009, here it is. Can you see? July 2009. Guys, they've been pushing this stuff for, for ages. Abruzzo is the region where I am right now. New flu. Uh, the date here, I guess, is the same, 2009, because it's... They're talking about this virus A, yeah. Yes, 2009. Here it is. So, you know, the same thing as if we had eyes to see, they were pushing this stuff over ages. You know, we have to vaccinate 24 millions of Italians. Italians are like 60 millions. So, and and Berlusconi guys says that I am not a saint. Uh, of course, you, you are a reptilian, you know that. And uh, this is what I use to clean. A bit of this wine, that this has turned to water, or maybe it was already water, who knows. And a bit of alcohol, alcohol. Uh, put it here, and it came really clean, man. And the good thing is that the, out there, there's the sun, so the... And if you believe it or not, guys, uh, with my phone you cannot see it, but just there is 3k guys, just exits the the, 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 the peak, you know, unfortunately with this phone you cannot see it, but it's the mountain, but just the peak, can you see it, <laughs> can't you see it, <laughs> like someone will answer back, let me turn this off and uh, if nothing fancy happens, we'll see, so I made uh, a huge mistake guys, uh, and what I thought uh, sooner or later would have uh, happened was, uh, uh, you know, that uh, maybe the police f uh, would stop me some, some one of these days, you know. It's like uh, 40 days that I'm out, you know. And sooner or later I would have uh, come across them. So it happened and, uh, and they thought that I, I broke into this house, you know. But... Uh, after they realized that I was just, you know, walking and uh, couldn't find any other way to sleep tonight. Everything is closed here. There are no hotels and nothing else. Then uh, he just took my documents and, uh, you know, reported me to the central police, whatever. And maybe... But he uh, told me that, uh, yeah, uh, after he uh, phoned to another guy that remembered that this house had a broken window, as I showed in the video. Uh, then he realized that, you know, I just, I was telling him the truth, so. So that's it, guys. Uh, <clears throat> I knew sooner or later would have happened, but, you know. Uh, maybe I will get something of, uh, in, in the mail when I return in my home, if these monsters would... Uh, or oh, want some money for me, which I don't have, so. but, uh, I mean, I, I have done nothing wrong here, guys. In fact, the guy was amazed that uh, uh, that I, you know, cleaned, and I, I told him, look, look at this place, man. I cleaned everything on the floor and everything, so. And uh, and he, okay, uh, while talking to another, he, he, while talking to another guy, you know, another, what happened here, guys? Uh, this phones not anyway guys let me stop this N nothing nothing wrong I mean for for me it's, it's just fine it's not problem I mean, these are the last days 
who cares if they will invent that I have broken into the house, you know. This house is abandoned, guys. It's like earthquake, as I showed, you know. And so, since uh, there's no other way in this place where I am right now to, to get a place where to sleep, what, 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 uh, what, what uh, could I have done? Nothing else. Now I was preventing the camera with my finger, that's why. So, uh, it's okay. See you later. So this is the next day guys, I find myself climbing this mountain just to get away as fast as possible from that place and I was saying, you know, the, the only mistake I made there was to start the fire before getting dark, you know, and so uh, the pigs saw the chimney smoking when they passed and uh, they realized that there was someone there, that's why they got me. You know, I was thinking um, of the pigs, you know, but instead of going after, you know, the pedophiles and the, and the other pigs like them that are pushing them to do what they're doing, you know, these people will be vaccinated soon, guys, they will be hundred times more dumb, you know, instead of going after this, you know, these people that are doing all this, they go after a poor guy that is just walking and wanted to shelter for one night. This is how rotten the system is, guys. So they told me there are bears here, guys, and I'm seeing some trucks here, but it's a small animal, like a fox or something. Oh, but what if it uh, snows? Or if it rains? If you said to a swimmer, you know that, uh, you know that you might get wet if you swim? I mean, if I uh, didn't plan that I will uh, be uh, met by the elements, like snow and rain during this walk, I would have not even started this. Man, this was one of the most beautiful tracks I've ever done, guys. With the snow like this, you know. So I'm going to this um, town, look at this. Look where it is. Huh? Now the sun is coming up, but it will snow heavily in the, when it gets dark. I hope I will find some place here, otherwise I don't know, I have to get to another town which is far away. 3K is just behind this, those clouds, guys. It's just a huge beast here in the middle. Here are the Jesuit guys. Anche il simbolo qua con i sei petali qua di questa stella a sei punte. Questo qua è dei templari. Però anche questa qua ha il significato loro. E poi le due mani qua, il simbolo di fratellanza fra queste due cose qua. So guys, uh, I wanted to, um, to talk about um, this guy that you just saw, you know. He was kind enough, you know, to, um, to let me sleep. Um, he said, yes, you can sleep at my place. I have a place where to put you. Okay, well, that's fine. Uh, he, he had like a, a place, of course, not in his home. And I agreed with that because, you know, I had no option here, guys. And so what happens is um, um, he invites me to eat with uh, his wife, this old man, you know. And um, I, I was amazed, you know, that he uh, invited me to eat. And uh, we had a conversation. I, I told them about the vaccines and everything, you know, because they were scared and everything, especially the lady. And uh, let me see if the light is on. And what happens is, uh, I thought, you know, after we ate together and we had a, a pleasant conversation and everything, you know, they would not dare to, to you know, to, to, to let me sleep uh, in this hell, here. And we guys, I mean, it was not even this place. They had, like, other places down in their basement, what I will call down the hall, you know. There was a place where they store stuff, you know, and it was less creepy than this, guys. But the lady said, you know what, uh, maybe that other building there, which is this one here, is better. This is where they had, like, uh, the forno, where do you cook the pasta, the, the bread, how do you call it, the, the forno, for, furnace, furnace, how do you call it? And so, so, can you believe it, guys? The lady, after giving me 
to eat and was nice and we talk, have a good conversation and everything. She said, why don't we put him he here? I mean, I already, you know, expected them at least to, to put me in some place in their home, you know, it's it warm. It's snowing, guys. It's just stopped right now, guys. Just right now, stop the snow. It's really cold, guys. And they, not, not even there, which was a bit better, look where they put me, guys. Look at this. There's a creepy candle that I, I put here. Look at this creepiness, guys. I mean, when I entered here, I couldn't believe it. Really, you want me to sleep here? Look at this. And, and he was like cleaning uh, with the, his feet like this down here. And and then I realized why these people... Uh, I mean, they do not do it on purpose, guys. These people are dumb, guys. And I'm not like complaining because I, I didn't ask. I mean, it's not that... Look, look at this, guys. Look at this shit, guys. These people have no, no shame to put the human being into such a shit. I mean, it, it, you make a, a, a better, uh, how do you say, look at this shit, man. I mean, just tell me, no, I have nothing for you. And not put me here, and like, I'm not, not like an animal. Look at this shit, man. And wait, so what happens? The, there was not even a bed here, guys. I moved around this town and I found this bad guys and I put it here because this moron wanted me to sleep just there and since it's snowing and there's no other place where to go guys I'm not whining you know it's just I'm just want to tell you this guys these people uh, he told me the, the the old man and his wife they take the vaccine each year guys these people are morons dumb and so there's nothing to, to, to get angry with them these people are, are really dumb, guys. That's why they are believing all the, they say in television like little kids, guys. And they would put a human being, you know. And, uh, listen to this other thing, guys. I went back at his home because I, I wanted to ask him, is there a bathroom here? Or I have to go in the town where people could see me and I have to pee just, just there, like that. He was like almost pissed that I, I, I ringed him at his house. And I couldn't believe it. I mean, I expected him to tell me, come on, let's uh, get get inside and use the bathroom in my home. At least the bathroom. But when I saw that he didn't want me to, to use his bathroom, okay, okay, I will manage, I, I told him to do it uh, somehow. Unbelievable, guys. So I, I, I just want to, I'm doing this not to whine, guys, because I, I have slept in much worse condition than this. I mean, this is really... I mean, this will be the worst if I really sleep here, guys, because I'm almost tempted since the snow stopped, guys, to just move, because this is too much, guys. I mean, how can you put a human being into this shit, man? Look at this shit, man. These are all, look, uh, spiders, guys. These are all dead spiders. Look at this shit, man. Unbelievable. And the lady had this idea. Hey, but instead of letting him sleep at that store where we store stuff there, which was doable, guys, it had electricity and everything, why don't we put him here? The dumb mind said that this is better, because there is less wind here, guys. I mean, less wind. Look at this shit, guys. It's open. There's no window here, guys. Look at this shit. Again, guys, I'm just showing this to show you how how done we are as humanity, guys. The this journey ends here, unfortunately, uh, because uh, because bad always wins over over good in this realm, guys. So there's nothing you can do about that. I was like hunt, hunt, hunted by by the cops here, guys, because uh, as in the movie Matrix, you know, uh, everywhere I moved. So this is the, the, the most I managed to, to do. And I was stopped. This was the last town. I couldn't get be beyond Nerito. Nerito, which, you know, has the, the name also has a, a black near to it. Nerito is like Nero, you know, uh, like, like the emperor. So Nerito is like uh, Nero, black. Nerito, it's, it's, it's funny, a funny name, Nerito, a small black, like Nerito. Uh, so, I managed to, to get 
even after this one, I got to, to, to this point here, which I was almost there, because my plan was to get to this small village here called Pat di Tivo, which was the closest you can get to 3K. Uh, and, and here you had like a really awesome view of the mountain. But it was impossible because after the police uh, caught me sleeping in this place here, guys, this creepy place, but again, I, I kept it clean, as I've said, you know, uh, I, I, I did all I could to, to uh, but the problem, guys, is the sheeple, the, the obeying sheeple. Because after I moved here, so first of all, the, the first mistake I made was to, to turn on the fire before getting dark. And so the sheeple around this small town called the police, someone is staying there, oh, well, what a great, you know, someone is, is using this. Look, guys, look at this place. It's earthquake. Nobody lives here. So I was just wa wanted that night to pass the night here. So anyway, I don't want to, like, uh, get angry. It's, I, I have already accepted uh, the sheep. I already know how the, the people work. And uh, bed will always win in this realm, guys. So just... To try to do all you can to, to save the spirit. The body, it's theirs, guys. This realm is hell. And I will explain you what happens in this last day. So, the police came here. They find me, guys. Look, I have the fine now. They find me uh, the minimum they could find me. So, let me show you. I don't care, man. Here's the fine, guys. The fine, and I have also to pay. They want me to pay like the. Uh, uh, 280 euros, Marcel Minga. Here it is from Albania. This this terrorist, you know, he he wanted to to walk in the mountain. How dare you? You know, here if they want me to pay like two taxes, pagamento, paying of taxes uh, and sanctions and other entries for the monsters that live on our backs. These monsters. And they, and they find me, you know, 280 euros, guys, which was the minimum because the cop that, uh, like, uh, was asked to, to come and check this place where I, where I was, you know, was a good guy. And also he said to me that uh, his mother, his uh, grandmother was Albanian. So maybe that helped a little bit. Uh, he was kind of nice to me, you know. And, uh, and we had also a conversation this last day. Uh, when he told me that, look, I have to give you this because uh, after I, I had to make the uh, the to register you as 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 you committed something because the, the people told me to come here and I had to to tell to my uh, superiors that so something happened here and so I had to say that there was this guy that uh, came from Rome. And it's, he's not supposed to be here because this is another region, guys. Believe it or not, Italy is united for the um, for the Masons that united it, but it's divided for the sheeple, guys. So, uh, okay, the next day they they came here. The next day I said, okay, please let me pass the night here because I have nowhere to stay. That's why I, I came here because there are no hotels here, you know. Because thanks to your COVID, your monsters. Uh, and there are the, the hotels are closed, guys, because of the COVID. Believe it or not. I, I was lucky a few times that I had uh, in this walk to, to get some hotel somehow because this region was in orange, like they have like colors, like, like little children, you know. It's green, it's, it's good, you can move sheep, which is never green. Or maybe it's like yellow, orange and red, but there's no green at all. <laughs> So, what happens, guys, is uh, I, I pass the night here. The next day, as you saw, I, went, I did that beautiful track, you know, with the snow and everything, beautiful. And, uh, and then I come to this other town. See this, guys, just like the, in the movie Matrix. When I came there, people already knew who I was, guys. The voice circulates. There was a cop there living in that other town and they already activated everything because 
a guy there in that town was so kind to um, uh, invite me in his home and even though he wanted me to sleep in that uh, hole there but they were nice people nevertheless you know relatively nice guys compared to how dumb these people are uh, but you know they, they were nice and they gave me lunch and I have to thank them for that uh, but he was visited he was visited because people already knew her have ears that this guy has invited me in his home and so there was a cop there in that town living in that town was called and visited the guy when I was there and while I was you know trying to, to uh, put the bed in that hole there to, to stay there this police there told to this guy what are the intentions of this uh, of this terrorist what what he wants to do so he scared these old people that invited me that were so nice to me uh, that at that point the guy that invited me come to me and he said look uh, what are your intentions I said Alessandro look if you want me to go away from here I will go away as soon as possible even if it's now snow I don't care do you want me to go away and he was like trying to, to say to me that this is it's, it's not it's, it's not in my it's not my fault that they want me to to to, uh, to get rid of you like okay they don't want me to stay here because I, I was a terrorist so it was impossible to move because they told me that there is another guy in the next town that I was going to go there is another cop there cops are everywhere and the sheeple guys are afraid even though as I explained to this old couple to do not be afraid of all this BS you know and everything I tried to explain to them but problem is after the police scared them guys they came to me with a mask guys this two old couple after I told them all about it, it's all BS they clearly told me guys that hey but, but if, if the law says so we have to obey just clearly guys that's why the, these people these animals these beasts are doing this to us because they know that the majority of the sheeple guys will obey will obey guys that's why we are ahead of us there's hell guys i mean a guy just wanted to walk in the mountain and it was impossible guys i was looked like a terrorist what do you want more to understand that we have hell in front of us so be strong find God because it's the only way to get away from the hell that you are about to uh, to, to be confronted with so now I'm waiting for my father uh, to come here so he had to come with his car here because there are no other way guys I cannot move from here because the cop would stop me and I am considered a terrorist and also when you go to the small towns especially here in this area guys there's all, only old people. Old people are only people that watch television, guys. They are totally dumb, guys. Afraid and see you as the television, the people in power want uh, them to see the others. They, they are afraid of everything. They believe only in television, guys. So what happens? So, so th that's it, guys. It's, uh, I mean, it, 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 this 40 days so much thing happened and I really liked you know uh, many things were positive uh, but you start to, to, to feel the 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 heavy uh, the heaviness of uh, life in, in this condition guys uh, people see you are terrorized guys uh, when they do not know you uh, especially if you don't talk to them guys you're already labeled as a terrorist guys so i have always all the time to salute these morons to tell them look i'm just hiking you moron can't you see i'm not a terrorist you moron never wear the mask in these 40 days and never the morons try to tell me but you should wear it no never never guys wake up guys these people are morons and what they want to die don't don't go and, and put the mask like these morons guys um, and fuck YouTube if you censor this video fuck you monsters so uh, 
you know, I was almost there, guys. For me, it was done. I, I did like 40, 50 kilometers. 450 kilometers. Uh, so it's like 300 miles in this one. Uh, who cares? It's, it's not the quantity of the miles, but, uh, you know, I, I guess this would really be, and I expected this to be so, the last walk the, 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 that I was able to do. And for me, it was a miracle that lasted so long, guys, with all the restriction and all the, the problem that we have uh, with people being in this state right now, guys. So, but, you know, at least... Uh, <clears throat> I was able to somehow, you know, pass some knowledge to, to, to those few ones, very few ones that wanted to listen. Uh, for me, the, uh, there were lots of people that I, I have to thank for, for all this work, guys. Especially, uh, you know, number one for me remains the guy in, uh, uh, what's the name of uh, the it, uh, there was a, this small town in, near Spoleto here. Let, let me see if I can find it. Spoleto? Patrico. Patrico. Man. Um, Alvaro from Patrico. Number one. And this guy put me in his home. Was the only one with Francesca and his... Uh, and, uh, his and, and uh, Francesca and, and Andrea. These are... Well, but there were also before this in Lazio other people that put me in, in their homes, uh, like the people in uh, I don't remember the name of the town because uh, they are old small towns. But they also put me in their homes. They also were good people, <laughs> even though we had some disagreement on uh, on uh, spiritual things. But uh, number one, Alvaro guys. These two people here, they were nice guys because when they uh, were telling me that you have to leave they they were like I, i'm the the uh, the woman the old woman was almost crying because she told me clearly i don't want to do you this to you but but i have to like uh, and i told her lady i just you don't have to talk i already see in your eyes that uh, you are good people even though you know you put me in that hole you know Something that Alvaro from Patrico didn't do, guys. He was, he had his mind and his conscience uh, sound, you know. Uh, but the rest of them, guys, can you believe it? As I said, guys, these people are convinced that the influenza that they get each uh, winter, they had to take the vaccine, guys. So imagine the damage that they have in their brain, guys, to make them so so weak so so i mean as i've said uh, if they do not understand guys that you cannot make someone sleep like an animal at least just tell me no i have not no place for you go away it's 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 100 times better but these people do not get it guys because these are blind spiritually blind guys they have no conscience guys i mean they they gave me lunch but they, they wanted me to sleep like an animal in that hole, cold hole. That I didn't sleep there. Because the cop there, when I left there, because I had to leave, uh, the cop, the, the, the same cop that caught me here, he was going around with his car to, to see where I was. And he called me while I was going to Nerito back. Nerito was that place where I stayed for two days, guys. Uh, that was that mess that I cleaned, you know, the, not this one, the, the other one before this. And uh, and I was going there because I had nowhere to, 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 to go. They don't, didn't want me to go in that side, which was the, the direction of the mountain where I was going. So I was going back and I meet the, the police, the, 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 the cop here. The same one that broke here, with was asked by the sheeple here to come here. And so, guys, you, you understand that uh, even the cop, you know, uh, uh, you can understand when, when you are talking to him, uh, you understand that behind that uh, uniform, he, he clearly told me that I have to do things because this is the the way to do things, you know, la prassi, uh, it says in Italian, like the, the, the procedure is like this, I have to do this thing. 
but understand that uh, unfortunately you are not desired here and if you continue to be here they will uh, like ban you from this uh, region uh, uh, he told me uh, he, uh, they would do to you like a ban for lettera di via it's like in Italian uh, so you could be banned from coming again from the, in this region so go away because you are risking uh, because I was not supposed to be here because uh, this is uh, my region where I live is red and I'm not supposed to have lived uh, another region and, and you understand guys that people are are just obeying things that people in power do to them without understanding where they are going they are creating hell without knowing because they are blind unfortunately uh, I gave my YouTube <laughs> channel to, to, the, to the cop and uh, you know if he understand English he knows that you know uh, I'm not very keen on uh, on order followers and uh, to a lesser degrees we are all order followers guys because to get the, those money uh, we have to to obey things that are morally not uh, not not uh, not good and he, at some point, he, he gave me this, guys. Uh, he, he told me, do you have anything to eat? So he, there you can see he was a nice guy. After he gave me the fine, you know, because I, I had to give you the fine, he said, you know. But he, 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 uh, he offered me uh, in the bar there uh, something to drink. I, I, I opted for, uh, for orange juice, but they didn't have orange juice in the bar, guys. Bar only sell... Uh, junk food, and so he bought me this, which which was with fructose and, uh, and and sugar and all that junk. But it's okay. What counts is the intention. And uh, at some point he told me, "Yes, I, I I see your point and everything. You like to do this. You are a nice guy and everything. You are an intelligent guy." He told me, uh, "You can almost like be a leader of a spiritual uh, thing, a religious thing." <laughs> Oh man, please. And he told me, look, uh, if you want, you can come back here where you stayed the, the other night and uh, pass the night here. So that's why you, you find me here to, to finish the night in this creepy place, guys. <laughs> look at this. Oh, man, this looks creepy, but if I didn't have this fire, man, it would have been impossible. And also, the good thing was I had also the bed there. So, so this is the end of 3K, guys. Uh, I hope you got something out of it. Uh, see you on the next one if God wants. <laughs> Here it is, Abruzzo. Bye bye, maybe the last walk. Ciao ciao. So this was the last place you know, where I stayed, guys. This is a creepy, creepy, creepy bridge. This is the name of uh, this kind of town. You know? There's the house again. That's a creepy bridge. 700 meters high. Waiting for my father to come. Is he able to carry the telephone? Medio more. 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 Medio more.